Hi, this is a um, small discussion on the chat scenario from both the sender and the receiver side in Woodme. Okay, let's go on the, the sender. So initially, basically we are we are here, we create the Moody, the avatar. Then we are able with the um, you know, Instagram like filters, the moods to set the mood. Okay. Then similar button here showing some hair. We are able to put some accessories. Trickier than it seems because we will have many choices. Here is mustache, here is hair. We need to figure out a way to maybe scrolling this to be able to show both moods, uh, emotions, or and uh, accessories. And here by clicking probably here, but that's to be defined, add text. Now moving forward here, text box with the keyboard displaying here, but this should be optional. So there should be an easy way for the user to skip and directly go to the selection of the friends. Here is a kind of list with you know the alphabetic A, L, as to be able to jump into the list all the friends with their picture and we can make multiple selection not only one we can send a moody to several friends in one go and then push here send that's a possible way to do it then on the receiver side you are in another app you receive a notification chandra sent you a moody and you click here to accept it you enter into mood me and um, basically it opens the moody that had been prepared in the first place okay you see the text i'm not sure here we need to display the moody's because one thing is i'm delivering to you a moody showing you how i feel is it important in the use case to be able to change the mood change the accessories here and you know keep the living portrait of my friend as a toy to play with or am I just showing the message with a button here to reply? And the reply is basically creating a new Moody, just like we did here, probably. So a few open questions and the devil is in the details. So we need to really think that carefully, obsessively minimizing the number of clicks. Right now, I'm frankly worried that there are way too many clicks. <laughs> so we'll see. Um, anyway, this is food for thought to help you in your reflections on how to create a user interface for that. Okay, cool.